This video provides information on the Pipeline Program, an immersive software developer training program offered by Nebraska DevLab. Nebraska DevLab, Needle for short, is an academic corporate partnership started in the summer of 2018 between Doan University and Don't Panic Labs. There's a shortage of tech talent in the Lincoln and Omaha region. This is supported by labor statistics as well as by anecdotal evidence and discussions with numerous companies in the region. The mission of Needle is to assist in addressing this tech talent shortage. Software development is one area of need where the demand for qualified software developers in the region greatly outnumbers the supply produced by schools and training programs. This imbalance is projected well into the future. Needle's pipeline program provides organizations in the Lincoln and Omaha region with another source from which to regularly obtain highly qualified software developers guaranteed. Thus the name pipeline program. The pipeline program is designed to start individuals with no programming or software development experience and in nine months train that individual to be a high quality entry level software developer. The outcomes, knowledge areas, and curriculum for the pipeline program were developed and are continually being assessed and updated using a number of sources including software engineering program guidelines produced by professional organizations and used by schools throughout the world, Professors of Computer Science at Doan University with over 50 combined years of experience designing and delivering software development courses. Professional developers and architects at Don't Panic Labs with over 50 combined years of experience designing and developing software on a daily basis. And an advisory group of software professionals from organizations who are sponsoring individuals in the pipeline program. Organizations who sponsor a participant are invited to be part of this advisory group. Best educational practices in effective learning are embedded throughout the pipeline program. These practices, illustrated here, provide participants a highly effective training experience not offered elsewhere. One effective educational practice used in the pipeline program is to immerse the participants in a software development environment throughout the 12 months of the program. The pipeline program is broken into four 12-week stages. During the nine months of the first three stages, the participant is immersed at Don't Panic Labs, eight hours a day, five days a week, for the 12 weeks of each stage. During that time, participants will experience direct instruction, lab assignments, and extensive software design and development, individually, in pairs, and on teams. Grades are not a part of the pipeline program. Rather, a competency-based model of education, another effective educational practice, is used where a participant must master all outcomes for each stage and demonstrate that mastery to their instructors and mentors before moving on to the next stage. The fourth and final stage consists of the participant, now with effective software development skills, immersed at the sponsor organization productively working on a development team with their mentor who has been with the participant since the beginning of the program. This stage is also the time when the sponsor organization will assess the participant's skills and if any expectations are not met, will work with Needle and the participant until they are. Material and experiences from several software development courses offered by Doan University and Don't Panic Labs are embedded throughout the pipeline program. At the end of the program, each participant will have earned 15 undergraduate credits from five courses from Doan University, which meet the requirements of a software development certificate from Doan University. In addition, project management is experienced and practiced throughout the program. All phases of the project management lifecycle are addressed and participants apply multiple principles of project management throughout the program. At the end of the program, participants will have earned three graduate credits in project management from Doan University, which can be applied to the project management emphasis of an MBA or Master of Arts in Management degree. Participants will be part of a cohort that will work through the entire pipeline program together. Cohorts, another effective educational practice, provide participants a natural structure of support during the program and the start of a professional network that will be valuable throughout their career. The pipeline program is designed so that multiple cohorts, each at a different stage, will be concurrently active. This provides opportunities for experiences within a single cohort or between cohorts. Such experiences are built into the pipeline program. Cohort size will be limited in order to provide the most effective experience for participants and will typically be kept between 10 and 20 participants. 
Ongoing professional development is important to all software developers. The pipeline program incorporates ongoing professional development into each participant's experience, even as they are being trained as a software developer. Professional seminars will be offered several times throughout each stage and will cover a wide variety of important and timely topics, and also provide the opportunity for unique experiences such as a planned rotation experience. In addition, the seminars provide another opportunity for participants to interact with program participants in other stages and with professional software developers from Don't Panic Labs and the mentors from sponsor organizations, all of whom will be invited to the seminars. One major benefit of an academic corporate partnership is that the strengths of each organization can be made available to the participants of the pipeline program. While Doan University brings strong academic course materials and experiences that can build the foundation of knowledge and skills in software development, Don't Panic Labs brings the opportunity to apply those knowledge and skills and learn additional knowledge and skills as part of a development team. In addition to cohort projects in each stage, participants will be a member of a Don't Panic Labs development team working on real-world projects. These real-world projects will include simulated projects with the same complexity as actual client-based projects, pro bono projects for the Lincoln and Omaha communities, and projects provided by sponsor organizations. The responsibility each participant has for a project will increase with each stage of the pipeline program. Mentoring has been shown to benefit both the person being mentored and the person mentoring. It is yet another effective educational practice. The pipeline program has numerous mentoring opportunities and activities built in. A participant will serve as a mentor and also be mentored. Of note is the mentoring relationship with the developer at the sponsor organization. This mentoring relationship will begin even before the program has started and will last not only through the program at Don't Panic Labs, but also during the apprenticeship and into the participant software developer position at the sponsor organization. The apprenticeship, yet one more effective educational practice, is the capstone of the pipeline program. It is more than an internship as, by this time, the participant will be a productive software developer, immediately contributing to a project team at the sponsor organization. This production provides some payback of the program cost to sponsor organization and also provides the opportunity to evaluate the readiness of the participant. If any expectations are not met, Needle will work with the sponsor organization and participant until they are. Activities will occur throughout the first three stages preparing the participant for the apprenticeship. The cost of the pipeline program to the sponsor organization for each participant is $25,000, a quarter of which can be paid at the beginning of each stage. In addition, the sponsor organization is expected to provide funding on which a participant will live during the 12 months of the program. This funding can be the participant's current pay, if an existing employee, or internship pay, if bringing in a new individual. The sponsor organization also needs to supply each participant a laptop computer. All other instructional and program expenses will be paid for by Needle. There are a number of ways program costs might be partially or fully offset. In conversations with companies, it appears that exactly how a company financially justifies a program will be unique to that company. However, several possible offsets mentioned by organizations are listed for consideration, including a graduated salary, avoidance of recruiting costs, use of an existing tuition reimbursement program, use of an existing internship program, and government funds through grants for retraining and apprenticeship opportunities. Of special note is that organizations currently interested in sponsoring a participant as an intern are viewing this as an opportunity to help increase the diversity of their development staff, as is well documented that women and most minorities are poorly represented in the software de development field. The first cohort launches September 30th, 2019. Doug Durham and Chad Michael from Don't Panic Labs and Alec Ingebrigtsen from Doan University represent Needle and were partners in the creation of the pipeline program. If you are interested in learning more about the pipeline program and how it can provide a regular stream of qualified software developers to your organization, please contact any one of them at the email or phone number listed. Needle would appreciate the opportunity to talk with you about the pipeline program and together explore how it might be useful for your organization.